Hello, welcome back to the Lanarkies channel. We are back at New Douglas Park as we take on Edinburgh City now. Team is unchanged, as you would expect. Convincing win, good performance last week, so I'm not surprised at that. I'm going to keep saying it though. I would like to see Kildee get more time. I would like to see Hasty. I would like to see Henderson. But, as I said, I can't begrudge the fact the team's unchanged given what happened last week. In terms of predictions, I'm going to say what I said last time. A bit nonchalant about these games now. I do think we'll win. I would like to see another convincing win. Um, I'll go 3 1 Aki's for a score prediction today, but as I said, I'm feeling a bit nonchalant about these games. It's just about getting to the playoffs and getting in a good run of form for those playoffs. So let's hope for another three points today and a good performance. Alright, folks, so for today's three point ups, please welcome our visitors, Edinburgh City, and Jack Rankins, Brian Wright-Arley, Hamilton Aki's! That was the biggest chance of the game so far. Ben Williamson with a shot for outside the box. Cannon's off the post and then Tully with the follow up. The keeper just toes it off the line and it's behind for a corner. Wow, Aki's very nearly getting the opening there. Two big chances. And just as we're getting to half time, Aki Rose again puts his ahead. Catch the ball on the counter attack, out to Tumulty, Tumulty across and it's just near post, he flicks it in by the keeper. Aki Rose with another goal there. Listen, we've not been playing great, I'll cover it at half time, but good to go in, go in at half time, 1-0 up. Another Aki Rose goal. Half time and it is Aki's 1, Edinburgh City nil. a goal right at the end of the first half there for Aki Rose, puts his ahead and um, gets on the route to 3 points, but it's the other than that, that first half is very, very boring. Um, really not much to bother you know if you're listening to an update from the first half, but kind of, we hit the post and we had that effort cleared off the line, but that was only kind of real clear cut chance, but other than that, we've not really been able to play any good little passing moves, neither have they to be honest, it's a lot of long balls, it's a lot of, uh, it's very very scrappy, that's the best way to describe it, it's a very scrappy first half. I'm glad to be going in 1-0 at half time, I think it went in 0-0 at half time in the city, but they came out with a bit of belief they can get a result, obviously they still can, but I think going into that first half really just needed their confidence, and hopefully we can kind of pick that apart in the second half and score a few more, make it a bit more comfortable, but I probably would be making changes, as I said it's a very scrappy first half, so I'd be making changes at half time. Maybe something like Jamie Barjona is on. Obviously, I hate Stair Henderson. They're also on the bench, as I mentioned before the game. So, aye. listen, not a great first half, but what a head. 70th minute, very, very little to report. Same as the first half. Boring, scrappy, no real clear cut chances by the side. Ben Williamson's down here. Looks like he'll be a sub, but listen, no real clear cut chances, and it's. Aye, it's boring. I don't really know what else to say. Well, you've been a boring second half, still one up. And... I think Touchwood will see this out, but it's not been an entertaining game by any stretch of imagination. And then my city very, very nearly going and get an equaliser. Miscommunication between Fergus and Dylan McGowan leaves them to run through. Dean Lydis makes a good first save and then he saves a follow up. It ends up being an Aki's free kick, free kick for offside, but very, very nearly equalised there in my city. I need to sharpen up Aki to get a second goal. Full time, and it is Aki's one at Edinburgh City. Now, listen, happy with the three points, uh, glad to be taking them, but that game was horrific. Um, as I said, kind of at half time and kind of throughout, boring, boring, boring game. No real clear cut chances for either side. We didn't really threaten them, and we found ourselves, as we have done a few times this season in the last five minutes, um, sitting back and Try to shut up shop, hold on to a win now win and no disrespect to Edinburgh City, but we should be looking to really kick on the second half, get a few more goals, but we weren't able to do it. But listen, it is still three points, that's the positive you can take away, but the performance boring, as I said, boring. Uh, lacked a bit of creativity, lacked imagination, and as I said, we found ourselves pinned back in the last five, ten minutes, which um is not what you want to be seen uh, in this league uh, against this opposition. So, I listen, as I said, we'll take the three points as the best I can say about today. Uh, thanks a lot for watching, really appreciate it. Next week we've got Sterling, so we'll see you for that.